Hi, I'm Steve. I'm with I-94 RV, and this is a 2005 Aerolite 27 RBSL. So this is uh, made by Dutchman, and um, just a actually great condition, beautiful used trailer we got, but it does have a couple of flaws. It's got leakage in the front wall and the floor, and it's got leakage in the back wall and the floor. Uh, beyond that, it's really clean and uh, very cool, very rare that you see this. It has a Onan Micro Quiet 4000 watt LP generator. So, uh, I mean, prices can vary on those things, but that's probably a three to $4,000 generator just to purchase it new, not including the installation or anything like that. So this is a really cool off-grid trailer here. So um, let's take a walk around it. Uh, so you got some pass-through storage here, and there's some of the crank handles for the jacks and stuff. It's got a nice big awning. Um, I think the previous owner said they replaced the fabric. We didn't have it out, but it looks clean. The edge that faces out looks clean. Uh, that's your water heater. Tires look like they have good tread. I don't know the age on them. They don't look that bad. So a nice double door trailer. This actually has a door to the bedroom. And then you got more pass-through storage here. Uh, kind of neat, this trailer, I looked at the unloaded vehicle weight and it states that it weighs 4,600 pounds, so nice and light. All right, Aerolite does a uh, ladder on the back, it's got a spare tire. This is sold locally by one of our, one of the dealerships near us. All right, they relocated, or they put a battery in the back. I think there's two batteries on this coach. And then there's sewer uh, hose storage there. Um, this side looks good, it's not damaged. The sewer dump is, is over there behind the wheels, tucked up nice though. And uh, there's a little bit of store, oh, that's locked, sorry. But there's a little bit of storage in there. You got the furnace, and then this comes with, uh, here's the cord, and there's your city water hookup. Uh, we ran the slide in and out, so it worked good. This is the exhaust pipe for the generator, the other side of the storage. And again, this floor is soft in here. All right, so this coach has two batteries on it. I don't know if they're connected together or not, but um, plenty of power to start that generator though. So I'll go fire it up. So very cool, don't see that very often. All right. So the front, this is a front living room style RV. And so the floor is kind of soft right up here. These are basically made with like Luan over foam. So it's a pretty thin floor, should be easy to replace uh, if you're handy. I uh, got some overhead cabinets. Um, Nice size kitchen, nice counters. Of course, the dinette makes to a bed. Put a TV mount here. Uh, there's like a radio or a DVD player there. And um, <clears throat> so there's a range, oven, microwave, and refrigerator. So a nice size fridge, like a six cubic foot. And then I'll just take a quick look in the bathroom. Looks good in here. The bathroom ceiling looks solid. So nice size tub. Uh, I got some height in here. I'm 5'11", and uh, got a built-in medicine cabinet. And then in the back bedroom, there's a uh, previous owner put an exhaust fan in, which is nice to get some ventilation. Got a queen bed back here, and I can feel the floor is a little bit soft uh, on this side. It's on both sides that way. And then there is lift-up storage under the bed. So this is a you know, good opportunity, a real cool 2005 Aerolite by Dutchman 27 RBSL. And uh, of course it has a generator, an LP, 4,000 watt LP generator by Onan. So thanks for watching.